So when it was announced that London was going to be holding the Olympics, um, I, like everyone else in London, was absolutely thrilled. Uh, and two seconds later thought, oh my God, what is this going to mean for how I'm going to get into work? The sort of major worry was the number of people that were going to be coming to London, you know, the sort of guests, the volunteers, the athletes, that the underground would just be so chaotic and crazy that um, travelling to and from work would just be impossible. In 2004, we started working for London Underground doing the Victoria Line upgrade. It was aimed at getting the railway up and running, ready for the Olympics. So this project where we were involved with Siemens Rail has went on for almost five years and we provided them with application engineering design support. The job was about taking the old trains and allowing them to run with a new signalling system and slowly as the new trains arrived the older trains were taken off. This meant that we had to have two levels of design. Scient helped us do the design to a high competence because we have to keep the railway safe at all times. Within the rail signalling practice, we have a talent pool of almost 300 plus engineers who come with rich signalling experience. Engineers have an IRSE licence. That's uh, an Institute of Railway Signal Engineers competency-based licence. All engineers having to work on London Underground need to have that capability. Scient were very flexible during the duration of the project. As the project progressed, we moved up to 106 people. Later on, towards the end of the project, the number went down to about 36. And after that, we've moved on to other projects where the numbers started to go up again. This has been a very collaborative relationship between both our organisations because Scient brings in the industry experience which is signalling, whereas Siemens Rail brings in the product and the technology experience. The project was very successful. The main aim was to get everybody to the Olympics and it turned out to be one of the best performing lines. Subsequently, the performance of the railway has been exceptional, actually better than the contract required. Unbelievably, during the Olympics, the underground was better. It's like some magic was sprinkled on the underground line and used in the tube was much better than before. It's amazing. No idea what they did or what was going on behind the scenes, um, but clearly something was and something went very right and has pretty much stayed right from then on in. Scient is a company that takes people and turns them into engineers that you want. <laughs>